Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. So this is cleared out. Oh, I still have the chair in my way. Dang it! <laughs> Surely should move that to a better spot, but it's too late now. I guess I feel uh, upside dizzy. Galaxy, shall we? Okay, we shall. One star, a walk on the weird side. The other place that has an unlock, you know, with the star bits, is also a one star galaxy for now, so yeah. And that a comet metal is pretty hard to miss over there. So yeah, we can explore this tower, but not from the outside, unfortunately. We have no choice but to go straight to the inside. Oh man, gravity. Oh man, you are you putting yourself into a vulnerable position right right to begin with. You just you did not start yourself on a good note here. <laughs> that box not the easiest thing to hit very swiftly, is it? <laughs> I'll just knock you for a loop there and take a look down low route here. Oh, well, that that certainly doesn't seem safe. But is there anything over there? I'm kind of tempted. Oh, that's it doesn't even let me check. <laughs> It's like, once you hit past a certain point, it just, just get flushed down the black hole toilet. <laughs> Alright, get back up. I'm just gonna get back over to where I was really quickly here. There we go. <laughs> so we're going up this way this time. And ooh, a piper. Ooh, a piper. Oh no, how are we gonna get to said piper? The piper. It's... It's at such an awkward spot. It's it's impossible. No one could possibly get to that. Well, actually, oh shoot. Well, uh, I was just gonna say. Well, actually, you just do it like this. What you do is you wait for the gravity. Ah, shoot. I need, you need some momentum here to do it. And you want to get on that under ledge over. No, no. <laughs> it's a bonus thing basically. So it's not essential or anything like that. But well, actually, hold on a sec. Could I like? Do this. This will make things easier. Yes! Ha ha! I like those apples. <laughs> so yeah, as I said, it's a bonus thing. But before I do this, let's go up here first and collect the coins. I don't remember if they come down with the crates. Well, actually, just to test that, I'll leave one coin there and begin the fire flower throwing spree. Yeah, they don't stay with the crates. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's actually a secret. Uh, I, it's not a bonus like I thought it was. Oh, I remember it now, so now we're not going to do this now. <laughs> going back this way, then. <laughs> Man, I'm just burning a lot of unnecessary time at this initial area, aren't I? And, oh, and obviously, if you want to get that, you just need to go and flop yourself over to... Uh, the top portion of the platform after you scoot yourself underneath the uh, platform as I showed you before during transition time. And dang it, uh, those coins are so inefficient to get. <laughs> I want that though. That's that's something that I definitely want. <laughs> oh come on, I was not in the gravitational field there. It sure looked like I was. <laughs> and oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> This is this is a little bit more finicky than I remember. Let me tell you. Okay, no, 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 no. I want to get on. I lost my spin because I was <laughs> now I'm kind of drifting here on my own. There we go. Yeah, you just like kind of lose control as to your forward momentum when you when you lose your spin. It's very very awkward like that. Star bits. Those are always worthy of getting. That, however. That's that I can't scooch under something to get. <laughs> I might have to do something fancy here. Like maybe just wait for that to come by and then just do one of these and flip flop over on top of it like that. Only the platform's gotta be closer. Oh uh, that'll do. Okay, what's in here? Stop it! Yeah! Okay, let's move on. Ow, my face! Oh, oh flip, flip, flip. There we go. <laughs> It's so weird when you don't like when you get stuck in momentum purgatory of sorts. Oh man! Oh man! I bet we gotta get up to that pipe. <laughs> uh, oh no! Yeah, it's probably best to clear out the Goombas in one pass and then continue on. Otherwise, <laughs> there we go. Goombas, their job 
was complete. Their, their job was entirely to stall you. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. New guy. They suck the life out of you. They're slurples. <laughs> mm, see, they get on your head like that. And, oh, maybe it's not the same as the other ones. Yeah, I was going to say they're similar to the uh, Yoshi suckers, but... <laughs> No, 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 they, they, they suck the life out of you if you let them on too long, and that's just coins, so what am I even, what am I even messing with here? By the way, obviously, you want to be careful when the gravity flips when you are, yeah, next to something electric, <laughs> yeah, just saying. Uh, let's just go shoot, I didn't mean to, oh, what the heck was that? I just kind of like, just kind of zipped to the other side. You're supposed to get that by being on top of that platform, but I just thought I would use my invincibility time to get get by there a little bit easier. Oh, no, I wanted to kill you using the block. <laughs> if that's even possible to do. I'm not really sure about that. Ah, nope, you can't. Okay. We now have learned something new today. <laughs> um... Let's go over here. I don't want to drop down there just yet, because there is... Oh yeah, I can only hit the block from the bottom. Technically the top at this camera angle. Uh, but yeah, the, the thing about it is you just, just gotta get things... Oh! Get things all right there, I guess. <laughs> uh, that's, oh sh that's not a very good thing to do. <laughs> and a switch fanciful... Yeah, that was perfect! It's kind of hard to do that without taking a hit there because of the gravity transition timing there, but that worked out very nicely. Okay, obviously, <laughs> Secret Star to be had there, so going back in there. Woo! Oh, yeah. Me and my organizational habits. I could have already gotten that and then gone back in for the regular star, but no. But no. <laughs> And upside dizzy secrets. Dang it, the chair is. <laughs> the pointer's perfect, it's just the chair giving me ire. <laughs> I cannot go through solid steel or whatever the heck this thing is. I think it's steel. Alright, so <laughs> back on a walk to the wild side. I mean, a walk to the weird side, but not for the same star. Oh no, no. It's for the secret star listed that I don't. Oh, 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 oh Ouija! Ouija, you're here! You're here this time! I will play as you. <laughs> Okie dokie! Yeah. Off to the secret star we go! Why did they take me back there? Why did that. That was weird! <laughs> I never I never played as Luigi on this one before to see that. <laughs> anyway, going around and using our spin to our advantage. Okay, so we're going to go grab our star bits that we have access to having trouble with the stairs. I mean, the, the, the chairs left and right. Oops. And then I want to go. Whoop, whoop. Man, I'm just going to give myself trouble. Come on, I'll just, I'll just do it with some patience this time here. There we go, see? Easy peasy. <laughs> uh, okay, so you know that there's a pipe hidden in the middle one, so we can just kind of break open the middle ones here a little bit there, and then go straight up, break that, go in, and call this a secret star. Oh, God! <laughs> It's worse this time in this galaxy. I'm going nuts here. We're getting more and more boxes of junk every day. Do me a favor and burn all these up right quick. What do you say? Sure. I have little hope that I'm going to get this on my first try. <laughs> I'm not going to touch the control stick. I'm just going to try and get these four crates straight out at the beginning here. Okay. So I'm just going to go to one side here and just kind of kind of fling fling stuff all to the other side. I'm not sure how how accurate this is gonna be, because yeah, I'm flinging at stuff from a distance here, and there's very little time going on here. Aw, oh, man. Maybe I should do the center method. Don't don't be mad at me. You shouldn't even give me a time limit. Oh, I will do it all! Put some elbow grease into it! <laughs> I would have definitely gotten that if you wouldn't have given me a time limit. You mechanical monstrosity. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I would. <laughs> and surprisingly, the crates are all... Oh, oh! Crates are all back. There must be some sort of loose connection that's happening there. 
And that's not good for my uh, confidence level in terms of hold up. I probably have to clear that and clean the contacts or something like that. Maybe, maybe. It's been a while since I've actually cleaned the contacts of this. But, uh, yeah, maintenance of the gaming is a thing. <laughs> this was a terrible run. <laughs> Like, maybe I should have stuck to the side... the side strategy. Man! Man, this is gonna be... a spicy meatball to get. <laughs> okay. Man, they just keep reappearing. Can I just, like, get them all from the, the starting location? Maybe I can. I just... spread fire and fury all over the place. <laughs> oh, shoot, that's not... That's gonna get two rolls of crates there. Uh, yeah, maybe I should be going for the double crate roll strategy there, like I did up above there. Ah, I think that is the key. Because I don't re remember exactly how I did this before. I definitely did it before, because I 100 percent of this game. <laughs> but it's it's not... it's not a very... Whoa. What is... Okay, I just jiggled it a little bit. <laughs> okay, different strategy here. To double rows here. Okay, we're gonna do all the lines, I guess. All the lines of crates going on. If there's a line of crates, I'm gonna throw a fireball at it. How's that sound? That looking looking pretty good, actually. Oh man! <laughs> I guess that's the strategy. Just go to one side and just aim at as many chunks of crates as you can in the line. I found this star and I was clean. Why don't you go ahead and take it? I don't think you are cleaning very, with very much effort, because if you want people to do that time, and you weren't the one that did the time, you're the one that's so angry about all this litter and whatnot that's going on here, I, I would think that you would have been able to do that during your own time limit, but no! No, you wait for someone else to come along and do it. <laughs> yeah! Alright, I think I'm gonna go ahead over to the galaxy that I can feed the uh, Aluma to, but first, it looks like it, we've got a little addition to our display gallery. Galaxy completes. Oh man, ghosts. Oh man, star bits. Oh man, coins. What do we get though? Fire flower. Finally! <laughs> That's pretty late in the game to be adding this to the gallery. Screaming pulsars, what in the universe is that thing? Looks like a flower with a face! Whoa! You, 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 there's a flower with a cloud, and you had less of a reaction to it over there. Never mind. It's a fire flower? Hmm, well, I gotta say there, you collected, collected some of the most interesting stuff I've ever seen. Uh, you, I mean, you collect. I, I, I read that wrong. <laughs> it's not you're collecting or, or something, it's you collect, yeah. I don't know why I did that, but... <laughs> Alright. Moving on... to another galaxy. <laughs> I mean, I could do one of the filler comments, I guess, maybe, but I think I'm gonna go over here, because then we're gonna be able to finish off said World 5 in the next part, probably. Looks like you found that we know the drill. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You are the hungriest one yet. A hungry, hungry Luma. <laughs> I aimed away from him so you could see its full body as it was expanding, but it just kind of automatically homes into him until I got past that point. Where it doesn't home in on him, and I just shot that star bit into oblivion. <laughs> Alright, new galaxy was born! And speaking of star bits, I think I'm actually gonna. Oops, that's not the one. Uh, wait, wait, no, that is the one. I'm actually going to uh, pull out a couple of star bits here because I wanna show you something in the future, and that involves not having. Uh, 999 star bits in the bank, so I'm gonna knock this down by a little bit here. Just knock it down to 9900 even. Uh, I was looking for a star bits in a cave, but I wasn't a pleasure to play our so called captain. Don't tell him I said that. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I just, I just took a little bit out of there for the future. Fleet Glide Galaxy. 
Indeed, if you're thinking what I'm thinking when I first played this, you would be right. Fluzzard is back. Fluzzard's Wild Battlefield Glide. And this one, not quite as scripted as the other one is. Let's just put it that way. It's definitely harder. Alright, you remember how to control Fluzzard? Tilt. Basically, and that's all there is to it. So wait, is this actually going to be a tutorial sign on how to... Yeah, it is actually going to be tilt Wii Remote to left to right a turn! Point Wii Remote down to do a nose dive! It's a fast dive, so be careful. Don't get your face hit in the lava. Hint! It's a combat medal! Hint! Five through five tiny gates! Five tiny gates! Yeah, yeah, it's that again. <laughs> and by the way... Uh, those are magmars, we're gonna see those on our flight through here, so, yes! Fuzzard! Fuzzard! He says you're okay! Don't you go climb with him! Are you going with Fuzzard? No, I wanna see your other dialogue. Too bad, so sad! Come back sometime to time and fly! Woo! I can't. I literally have to exit to the map. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I would like to fly with Fluzzard on this bonus galaxy. It's not too long to do. If you can glide through the big sun circle at the end, you win! You win! But it's not easy! Not easy! <sighs> I'm gonna need my full concentration to do this. So no commentary. Okay, I gotta commentate. <laughs> so I gotta dive immediately at the beginning here to get through that gate, of course. Uh, gates mainly attached to the floor, because that's just kind of how they attach the stuff. And as you can tell, you can go around in circles, like all around this thing. That's why it's not uh, scri whoops, scripted in the slightest, <laughs> like the other one. So it's, yeah, there's actually some stuff to deal with here, and I, I totally flubbed my turn demonstration there, but that's okay. You have plenty of lives to mess around with. Magmars, they aren't messing around, though. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so for the most part, you just want to follow the star bits. Yeah, like, see these star bits here? Yeah, oh shoot, that's not... <laughs> because they lead to the gates! Ah! Yeah, if you hit something really directly, you'll lose a life, but if you just graze off of something, you'll be okay. <laughs> that's okay, that's okay, we're good. <laughs> and bats hanging out over here, having a good time. I definitely have got to get underneath that thwomp, like, <laughs> how, was <it? laughs> how was I supposed to offset the timing of that? <laughs> I definitely need to get the, underneath that thwomp, though, to get to that gate. <laughs> Again, like the other one, I've got to get the Comet Medal as well as just the regular Star Run all at once, otherwise it won't count, so this, this all counts for one... Oh, shoot, I nicked the top! <laughs> This all counts for one big run that just, just like all in one round of sorts. Alright, let's go! <laughs> I'll get it eventually, I assure you. <laughs> Even if I have the game over. Maybe I should actually be going for that mushroom instead of the gates. No, we need the gates. <laughs> yeah, if I'm gonna take that much damage... <laughs> Nah, we'll go. Oh, shoot. Nah, we'll be okay, I'm sure, eventually. Just need to kind of be a little bit more careful about things. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Should not die that close to the ground, man. <laughs> okay, offsetting, or at least going to try to offset the timing of the thwomps by diving now. I think that'll do. Yeah, I should have been looking ahead a little bit better than I did. Okay. God, I should really get that coin there. <laughs> it's not happening. It's not happening. It's kind of tricky to control Fluzzard a little bit when you're trying to dodge stuff and you're a little bit worried about death. <laughs> so you have got a good run going here. But I think we're going to make it this time. There's our glass bubble that'll explode. Yes, yes, yes. Get it, get it, get it. Yes, thank you, Arceus. Thank you. <laughs> All right, there's our run for both at once. <laughs> and as you know, if you don't get the, the checkpoint or a star, you lose on your Comet Medal, which is why you've got to get them both at once. <laughs> That's okay, though. And this time, so I don't have to go back to here to get their dialogue, I will indeed re-talk to them just to see. <laughs> So before I forget, uh, really? Okay, that's the same thing that 
it, it, there's nothing else? And those gates aren't that tiny. <laughs> uh, do you have anything if I just A button you? No? Will Fluzzer talk? No? Will the signboard have different dialogue? No? Okay, we're out of here. <laughs> Clear for now. Because, you know, it's not, it's not Silver Crown or anything. Anything like that, so... Well, it's done. <laughs> For now. Any sort of comet unlocks? Maybe? Might be? Who knows? We'll see. Nah, I guess not. So with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when we do... One Comet, one Kirmo, and one Bowser's Castle. <laughs> That's not like Bowser Jr.'s castle, tower, abode, I, I don't know. <laughs>